All right, so uh, welcome back to Hammer of the Gods, the bad boys of New Alexandria. It's been a minute since we streamed. Um, I've forgotten how to do everything. So we're just going to pick back up. Um, Tim, I know you were asking since you had to miss the last session. Um, the last session you were on, you guys had, I think, just gotten to the Pandaro School of Magic. Um, Bayon saw his one true love, Kina, who is now his teacher and told him to fuck off. And um, I'm hot for teacher. It's true. Um, you guys have a test in her class, like immediately. And I'm trying to think. Oh yeah, you guys had gone um, back to the Warty Hog Tavern where Nikitas was just about to get into esports for the first time um, when we ended that session. Um, mostly because we were bullshitting and talked <laughs> for like two more hours about not D and D. Um, play esports; it tends to it tends to get away from you. It it sure do. It sure do. Um, so since then. I don't really know what Nikitas has been doing. We'll, we'll figure that out in a minute. But Bion was hanging out with not Nikitas, Natatas, if you will, um, who was another changeling. Um, one of the whisperers, the IA people who had come and questioned you guys after um, the whole Demetrios and Carnival scene, had basically tailed you guys and was like explained to Bion that he was being watched, you're being watched, just to make sure you're not doing anything actually shady, because they're sort of questioning that at this point after the Demetrios debacle. Also the Baklava debacle. You know, as one as one do. The great Baklava bandit. Bandito. <laughs> <laughs> um so with Nautatas, Bayon got into a little bit of a uh, scuffle with some steam methods in the kitchen of the Warty Hog Tavern. And then he invented baklava pizza. And that's where we ended our last stream. So is that the, was, is that the, is that the, is that the one shot adventure I missed? Oh, it wasn't a one shot. It was just like a, it was just like a regular thing. But, but yes, you missed it, Tim. Yeah. Okay. If you had been there, I may have actually gotten something done besides creating baklava pizza. But I'm be... fighting three whole steam methods, mostly yeah, by I, yourself. I don't think I killed any of them. I think I just like no. You definitely killed one. It exploded. I, was say, I, I just think I annoyed the, uh, <laughs> the other cop until you were like, "All right, I'm done." <laughs> Not a toss. Was like, "All right, fuck this." Because <laughs> <laughs> I kept being like, <laughs> I kept being like. Yeah, but Normalitas, you're so good at combat. You do it. <laughs> With my oh. zero spells. <laughs> I was sus that it wasn't really Normalitas, so I was trying to prove it by getting him to do combat. Yeah. Uh, it didn't so, work. So, where we're going to pick up, we're going to do a little bit of uh, backtracking. So, Nikitas, Normalitas, um... Where we left off with you, like I said, you were about to get in on the uh, Mage Hand ball game when there was a commotion. The head chef had come out and was yelling about how the steam is too spicy. You saw really not a whole lot because there were so many people that the whole tavern went nuts. And you and Bion, as well as Neon, I forgot Neon was there. Um, <clears throat> The three of you all got separated. And so as kind of the crowd all makes their way out, Nikitas, you see a fairly familiar looking little dwarf who just kind of is standing there staring at you. Is he in my way? It looks like Bion, and yes. <laughs> <laughs> Um, and hey, 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 Bion, um, I, I, I need you to move. I got to get back to the dorm. I have to study. This test is fast approaching. Ah, yes. 
nor naked. You? Yes. Hey, wait, 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 what were you about to say? Um, I'm, I'm, I'm no Malatos. Bye, I'm yes, you okay. I, you're, you're sure? You're right. And you see that this dwarf has a very flat booty. Hmm. Uh, can I roll a, an insight check? Yeah, you don't even have to roll. You're like, this is sus as fuck. Hey, trail, <laughs> I feel right now. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I think I have to roll an insight check, though. Okay, good. Well, because even with the flat booty, I would just assume, hmm, what happened by how? <laughs> <laughs> Were they fake the whole time? His uh, implants finally, finally let out. Uh, so uh, at, at first notice of that booty is not as bootylicious as a booty should be for Bayon. I want to uh, play along. Um, obviously, something's askew. And I want to look around and see if there's any signs of my real friend, Bion. Okay, so uh, as you're looking around, you hear that in the kitchen, there's some kind of like shenanigans going down. Um, but the, the head chef is just like, Oh, my, my goodness, I, I'm so glad that you're, you students are here. Um, yeah. Um, so, Bayon, would you like to come check out what's going on in the kitchen? No, 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 no. I do not like kitchens. Yeah, me neither. <laughs> Should we go back to the, to the dormant study? Yes, absolutely. I love studying. Let's study. Okay. And then as we get ready to leave the Warty Hog Tavern, I want to uh, shut the doors and lock them out. <laughs> okay. Uh, You're not by on. <laughs> <laughs> You're not my real by on. <laughs> I, I know that booty from opinion. anywhere. Uh, and, then, and, then, and then obviously after I do that, I, I assume that the commotion from the kitchen is from by on. It's, it's yeah, so related. I, I would say uh, roll a sleight of hand to see how well you can do that. Uh, eight, seven plus one. Yikes. They got a seven. So. <laughs> hey, he's, he's like, let me open the door. I'm like, no, we got to shut the door. It's like, we're like a stalemate holding the door. <laughs> and uh, now, it's, now it's just awkward. Now it's like we're holding the door open for people. <laughs> and not on, not by on. Um, it's just like, oh, this is a, this is a funny joke. You. Ha uh ha. -huh. Let me in so we can study. Oh, okay. And I want to, uh, when he walks in, let's see what spells I have at this level. I want to cast Suggestion. Okay, can I okay. cast Suggestion? Uh, he's got to make a... Wisdom saving throw, and if not, he has to uh, follow my suggestion. Okay. Sorry, I was responding to Derek in the chat. Uh, and the DC save is thirteen, or for wisdom. Ooh. Uh, what happens if he if he passes? Nothing. Okay. So nothing. I mean, yeah, he, he can still do my request. I say, <laughs> tell, <laughs> tell me who you really are. I am Baya. And he says it just like that. It's very <laughs> believable. All right. Let's cut the shit. I like pull him to the side. All right, I thought you shut him outside. <laughs> I thought you shut him out of the door. <laughs> oh, I thought, oh, oh, I thought we, we all, we, we came back inside. We had a stalemate. People were just getting awkward holding the door open. So I said, come on, come on back in. Um, all right, obviously you're not my friend, Blyon. What are you doing here? And who are you? Why so, do you look like him? As you say that, this person just shifts. Uh, you recognize, you know, the like grayness of just like the bland changeling. Um, I did the same thing, and I look just and I look back at him in my um, Morpheus face. Right. So yeah, I mean, as they do, they just like, all right, look. Oh yeah, that's my voice too. <laughs> <laughs> He's just like, yeah, you're a changeling. You're you're with my clan, huh? <laughs> He's like, look, your boss sent me here. You guys are under investigation. Just quit fucking up. Who's our boss? Fucking tell him on. Oh, I was just I was just testing you. <laughs> and he do, just you your, do you have your badge? He immediately just walks off. He shows you the badge and he's just like, fuck off. 
okay, we won't be under investigation anymore. Uh, and then I want to uh, go back to looking like bland old normal normalitas. And um, now that I got scolded by teacher, um, my head's down, and I want to just go collect Bion and go back to our dorms and study so we don't fuck this up. Okay. So you, uh, you head towards the kitchen, and you see Bion walking out looking absolutely moist as fuck. Uh, first thing I want to do is check his booty, make sure it's uh, the official booty of Bion. Extra thick. At like, least like, like six like feet. Like, like too six extra feet. thick? Like suspiciously not buy on thick? <laughs> no, like standard buy on thick. Okay. Like hey, dummy thick. <laughs> buy on, you're never going to believe what just happened. Did you encounter somebody who looked just like me, but that wasn't me? I mean, not just like you. They had a small booty. It was a dead giveaway. Excuse What? Oh, I know. It was, it threw me off too. It was, it was unnatural. Oh, and it, it was not small. It was like Hank Hill inverted booty. Yeah, it was Hank Hill inverted booty. Who's Hank Hill? You know, <laughs> Hank Hill. He's the owner of the of of Hank's Tavern over on the hill. Yeah, he's the hill giant. Hmm. I guess I'll have to go check that place out. There's no ass to be seen. Yeah, he's famously known for having no booty. Does he does he sell ale making and ale making <laughs> accessories? Probably, Probably, allegedly. Ale and ale making accessories. <laughs> All right. So, hey, Bion, uh, Bion, do you want to come back and study with me? I'm really nervous about Keena's test. Studying? Mm -hmm. Can't you just pay your way through school? <laughs> well, I gave him my money away. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, I have plenty of money. <laughs> Well, I mean, if you're if you mean for sure that I'd, I'd really feel more comfortable if we studied, but just in case the money thing doesn't work out, money can't buy everything. It may buy happiness, but it, it can't buy a good grade. Money can absolutely buy a good grade. Trust me, <laughs> or at least a C. <laughs> <laughs> at least a C. But I'm an A plus student. I need to I need to do that. Normalitas, my friend. Gold decrees get degrees. <laughs> and I right drop there. like five gold coins on the table. And uh, immediately immediately the, the head chef is just like pockets them. Like, oh, somebody left a tip. How generous. <laughs> uh, no normalitas, before we go back and study like a couple of squares, did you try my baklava pizza? <laughs> I, I did not. Uh, I, I would love to try it, I guess. It's, it's over there, and I guess gesture towards where there, I'm assuming, where there's some left. And I yeah. follow his gesture. In the, in the kitchen, there's just, that. like, all but one bite of a baklava pizza, because no one else has touched it. Uh, yeah, I guess I'll take a knife, uh, like a knife, and kind of cut myself a slice off. I'd like to roll a d20 to see if I can persuade him that it's delicious. <laughs> <laughs> you can roll with disadvantage. You don't even need that. <laughs> uh, I would like to bluff and, say, and tell him that it is delicious. <laughs> do it. Do so it. I'm going to do a deception. Mm, hey, mm, 23. This is <laughs> the best baklava pizza I've ever had, and I've never had it before. And the first baklava pizza anyone's ever had. This I is know. absolutely fantastic. You should definitely write down the recipe inside of your journal and then <laughs> never tell anybody about it and never make it again. That's what makes this so rare. Wow. Is, is that nobody else can ever have it. That's great praise coming from you, Nomalitas. I know that you enjoy eating mainly just chicken fingers, but this would be great. <laughs> Every restaurant, like no matter what kind of restaurant it is, just chicken fingers. <laughs> Vegan restaurant. Yeah, I'd like the chicken fingers. <laughs> or, the or, chicken. Just, or just fingers of, of some kind. Just fry up some fingers of anything. It'll be fine. Do you yeah, have fingers? Have I'll eat them. Mandrake fingers? Uh, human fingers? I mean... <laughs> yeah, I mean, you're not human. It's fine. Everything's fine. Yeah, everything's Human fine. fingers? I don't know. Lady fingers, though. I need to be able to do that background thing that Tim can do. You just... you. Click the little button. Well, there's somebody else in Tim's house. Oh my oh, god! No. Tim, are you being I'm not alone? <laughs> <laughs> but when I do it, I should have done this before we started. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> I don't have like it tells me that my my I don't have a green screen. You've been locked. 
<laughs> if I do that, that's what I do. <laughs> oh, look at me. Maya, where'd you go? Maya, what is that? There's a demon on your face. It's a smith. It's like a steam method. Like, I, I don't have any way to do it, so I don't know. I try to hit him with a pan. <laughs> anyway, sorry. I'll worry about this later. Uh, meaning you'll forget about it until next time, and then you're like, I should have done that before. <laughs> yeah, I just think it'd be really cool to have a little buy on up, up here in the up here in the corner. Instead, we just got your wife. I mean, yeah, she's pretty not, cool. It's too. not the same. Yeah, it's not the same though. Yeah, she's pretty cool. She's all right. Yeah. So, yeah. hey, anyway. Bion. Hey, yeah. hey Bion. Wait, um, sorry. Back to the game. Sorry. This, this pizza is really great. I mean, you know, I can't even eat anymore. It's just so filling. It's so dense. <laughs> he hasn't um, even taken a bite. <laughs> he just like um, cut it off and then like, like, like you, when you pretend to eat something and you drop it down to your dog in the, under the table. Uh, um, Hey, Bion, so I, the, the, the not Bion, um, he, he let me know that the Telemon is on us. He said that we're making too much of a ruckus and that we're starting to be investigated by the school. We, that's, that's like a double failure. Not only am I not going to get an A in he and his class, but we're going to get kicked out of the mission and as, as a failure here too. So we really have to turn this around. So Dan, Bion knows from Nautatas that it's, it's IA, it's not the school. He may not understand those words, but, <laughs> <laughs> but he knows well, like, it's not actually the school investigating you. I mean, I have a 13 intelligence, so I understand some of these words. Yeah. <laughs> I have a 16 intelligence, and I, uh, but I know what the words are, but my wisdom's know. not. So I know what they are, but I don't know what they mean. So what you're saying, okay, so when I talked to Nautatos, who looked just like you, <gasps> What? Uh, his booty was the same and everything. It was wild. <laughs> so whoever was playing me must not know how to do the spell as well as mm. not a toss. Anyway, yeah, it's uh, a spell. Yep. when I was speaking with know. him, he was saying it was the IA that was investigating us, not the school. The are, they, are they the same? Because I don't know all of these words. Oh, yeah, the International Assassins? The Guild of International Assassins? That sounds they, they're, they're, af they're after us? Dude, so God. Oh, as you guys are, oh no! As you guys are conversing, the doors to the tavern burst open, and you see this like squad of six metallic creatures with like blank-looking faces. If I remember right, I immediately cast heat metal. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> that's, a, that's a joke. Roll it back. Roll it back. No, Roll back. No, 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 I'm just gonna. I'm, I'm just gonna no, watch. No, no take back. Sit back and uh, watch what happens there. <laughs> my aunt is dead. I am all that uh, remains. <laughs> R.I.P. in pieces, my dude. <laughs> um, <laughs> How are we gonna retcon the other episodes? <laughs> <laughs> it's his twin brother, Ion. Wait, what? What? Did what? You say, did you say Bion's twin brother Ion walks in? No. <laughs> we, were like... how, we were talking about how he died. <laughs> I was like, oh my god, what a twist. <laughs> Tim's like, I can't even follow this game that I'm in. <laughs> hey, we may, maybe the changeling was the real Bion, and this is an imposter. <laughs> Mother of God. You've just been Bionception. I would also just like to take this moment of intermission to say that I'm proud of all of us for wearing sleeves today. Secretly uh, take under this jacket the... off. Uh, yeah, I have no sleeves on. <laughs> I was going to say, under the jacket, he's just not even wearing a shirt. <laughs> well, well, sure, Tim, but like that's like me saying, like if I take off my shirt, I'm also not wearing sleeves. Oh, Tim's gone. Oh, he's back. But that's a jacket. Jackets are like the outer layer over what's supposed to be a shirt. Let's be honest. My shirt could be a jacket for you, Rick. <laughs> <laughs> You're not wrong. But, it could be know. a whole. It could be a whole ass coat for you to go to Mount Everest, and you would you would be fine. I don't even need an ass coat, but you know, I'll take it. Hey, hey, Bion. But before we actually do go back, <laughs> I do have a question for you. Yeah, I have. I have an answer, but maybe. Hey, do do you? I'm trying to check my my notes and my uh, take out my journal. Um, do you recall why we were sent here? Oh yeah. <laughs> what? You guys are looking I, for um. Uh, what the fuck's the dude's name? Demos. Yeah, we're still looking for Demos, and we thought maybe he was going to school here, I think. Okay, yeah. so everything we've done so far is really counter to that. We haven't asked about Demos once. <laughs> Do you remember Foghorn Telmon? 
I do. <laughs> he he told us to come here. Oh, I do remember that. That's that's in my uh, my task journal. I just need to know what we're going to do about this International Association of Assassins. This is very frightening to me. Uh, me as well. I think this this goes a lot deeper than we might have originally thought. Um, do you think Do you think Demos is the captain of the International Assassins? I was thinking more of he may have been a victim of the International Guild of Assassins, but you're right. Anything's on the table. Oh my god. We haven't figured anything out yet. No, nothing. Just like every investigation, all we, you guys all we know, <laughs> all we know is that the IA is on our case, and, uh, and I don't know if I can fight off a horde of assassins. Oh, sweet baby Hephaestus, help us! Oh man, okay. Little six pound, eight ounce baby Hephaestus, <laughs> hammer in hand. <laughs> is he wearing a tuxedo T-shirt though? That's how Tim likes to picture his Hephaestus. <laughs> Oh, oh yeah, for sure. It says, but like, but no, but so like in like a tuxedo with the with the tuxedo tie, but sleeveless. You know, <laughs> sleeve, sleeveless as, tuxedo and tie. As a lead singer for a Lenardius Skinnerdius cover band. I feel like we've already made this joke at least twice. <laughs> hey, listen, that's all I do. The same joke over and over again, but you guys keep laughing. So <laughs> true. Yeah. true. Anyway, so back to the okay, but anyway, Nikitas. No, 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 my bad. Wait, wait, how did you buy on? <laughs> how did you figure know? that out? <laughs> what do you know? <laughs> Not a lot. I know how to make baklava pizza. Anyway, we'll Man. worry about our grades and we'll worry about this international assassin band in a minute. Right now, who are these metal dudes? Oh, yeah, I forgot about them. Um, <laughs> I'd like to. What? Do you think one of them could be Demos? So they have like these almost gemstone like faces. It's almost like a, a polished, sort of like a pearl, but it's more of like a, a stone, like a gemstone. Uh, kind of can, look to it. With, with an arcana or my history of arcana, can I gather if they are uh, like humunculus or some sort of uh, like golem? Sure. Or are, are they real people? Is that, was that, is that an arcana check? Oh, well, yeah. Natural 20 plus five. Nice. Five. Uh, they are absolutely constructs. Hey, these are not golems or whatever else I said it was. These are constructs. Bion. They're not real. They look pretty damn real. And uh, the, the lead what? one says, I'm absolutely real. Oh, shit. Uh, they're right up on us. <laughs> <laughs> and someone, <laughs> someone reported that there was a disturbance of the peace. So they sent the DTP. The down to party? <laughs> nice. nice. <laughs> no party here. We we're just studying for our test. Do they have any chains with a DTP pendant at the bottom of them? No. Well, that's rude. Like they're they're not wearing. They're just like these metal. Um, they've got like more of the gemstones kind of in their chest, and they they don't look quite like people. They almost look like um, like hall monitors in school. Yeah, because hall monitors are not people. <laughs> Anybody who rats a kid out for taking a pee is not a person. <laughs> oh man. Down with hall monitors. <laughs> Nerds. So, instead of looking <laughs> instead of looking totally human like, um they they have two arms, two legs, they've got like a head, they're humanoid, but they don't have like a face, they don't have um digits on their hands or anything like that it's just um almost like they're made out of like quicksilver but okay. they're solid um so um excuse me mr dtp um we, we I, are I think, the dtp we we are all dtp yeah i think i know what happened you see what happened was uh we were all having a good time we were playing some mage ball and then there was an explosion in the kitchen of some delicious pizza being made and uh there may be the International Guild of Assassins um, in town. You might want to look more into that. There is no there is no International Guild of Assassins. I'm pretty sure that you're wrong. But if you go into the kitchen, you'll see a pizza. That That is the commotion. That is what you should be concerned about. A they say, pizza. we were told there were methods out of control running amok. Is that true? I wasn't there for that. I was doing something else that day. <laughs> 
<laughs> we'll have to rely on my butt. <laughs> Despite the fact that they have no facial features, you can just see the frustration. <laughs> you should probably talk to my friend Bion. Like, like instead, of, instead of this, like uh, almost like a darker blue than Dan's shirt. Um, at least it looks blue in this. This I don't know if it's actually blue. Yeah, it's it actually kind of looks like Sully from uh, Monsters Inc. Nice. Yeah. I mean, it's definitely, it's definitely more of that, like the darker blue. Um, and it, it just like, you see that it becomes more clouded, clearly showing some frustration. Um, and yeah, the, the lead DTP agent just says, please explain, were there methods or were there not? Did I know that those were methods? Yeah, absolutely. Yes, yes, Mephits, yes, the, the little steamy guys. Uh, yes, yes, yes. yes. Some of them they are. were in there, and like I gestured towards the kitchen. And they, they, made just... that, they made that atrocious pizza. Yeah, listen. I got you, Byron. <laughs> atrocious? What are you talking about? I mean, I mean, it was... The, it's, it's, it's Wait, no, 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 I get it. It's for the con, it's for the con, it's for the con. While you two go back and forth, two of them just like push past, or they just like shove you both out of the way, and they walk into the kitchen, and then a few really? seconds later, walk back out, and they say... We destroyed the pizza. That's all. And I just walked back out. Bon, this is safer for everybody. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just like standing there, just like completely stunned because this was this was my piece de resistance. This was my <laughs> <laughs> this was his life's purpose right here. My father brews the best ale in all of New Alexandria, and I was going to create the ultimate dessert pizza to go with his ale. And now it's ruined. And you just make never it know. I mean, you could just make it again. It's no, you told you me. You told it's me to write it down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You should. Listen. I wrote it down, and now it's it's lost forever in my annals of history. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, at this point, the tavern owner says, "All right, folks. I think it's time to to call it a night. We're going to close a little bit early." But I don't want to do that. Well, you can either get out <laughs> or the DTP can come back and carry you. Hey, out. hey, by on the International uh, Guild of Assassins was, was really clear that we don't want to make a disturbance. Otherwise, they'll investigate further into us. So <sighs> we might want to just keep a low profile here. Okay. Let's yeah, just so go study. Let's just go study. That, sounds, study. Like a, that sounds like a great idea. Save us bet. No one's going to kill us for studying. Okay, yes. <laughs> Except maybe me. <laughs> So as you make your way, um, you don't actually know where your dorms are. So you, like you walk out of the, the tavern and as soon as you do, you're greeted by this small creature. Um, Is it cute? Oh, it's very cute. What was, a uh, fuck, I just listened to this yesterday and now I can't remember. What was Gil's little uh, animal companion? Mm. The one that we forgot about? Mm-hmm. Oh. Bat something. Yeah, it was a bat. It seems to be a common theme. Oh, it was like a, a mere bat. That's it. Yeah. Yeah, a so, mere bat. Yes. Yes. So forgot all about it, it's that this like long cat with hairy bat wings. And it its front two paws have a little um, bound parchment that it just holds out towards both of you. I immediately throw my arm over Normalitas's chest. <laughs> Careful, Normalitas. This okay. might be one of the International Guild of Assassins. It's clearly rabid. I just think it's a, I think it's a cute little meerkat. Yes, meerkat. you think that. It's a meerbat. It's a meerbat. It's a right meerbat. Allow me, allow me to be sure. And I'd like to roll a knowledge of knowledge. Knowledge well, meerbat? While he does that, I'm it's just walking age. over and, and grabbing <laughs> the parchment from the near bat. <laughs> okay, so you grab the parchment, and it's an invitation. It says, all new students, please report to the main hall for orientation. Uh, do you know where the main hall is? Uh, I'd like to roll to see if I know where the main hall is. As you say that, you see that there's like fireworks going off in the distance, and you see that's the main a hall. big yeah. You see a big banner that says 
Welcome, new students. <laughs> Rick's over here doing everything he can to make sure that we don't <laughs> get derailed. Oh, I feel like we're on a. You're gonna get railed. I think we should just hop on this train <laughs> and go to the. Uh, Wait, main, train? Uh, There's no main train. All celebration. It was a joke. We're oh, rail. <laughs> I was like, "There's no <laughs> train, sir." It's a, it's a joke because it's we're being railroaded. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Oh, but... sorry, guys. <laughs> I quit. I'm done. I'm done for the night. <laughs> She takes his hat off, signs <laughs> off. We never see Tim again. <laughs> uh, all right. So, anyway, you guys making your way towards the main hall? Of course. Cool. Can't, can't think sure. of anything else we would do. <laughs> can't I'm going to be very, this. <laughs> gonna be very suspicious the whole way. Okay. So, you're, you're just, like, looking around all sus. And you see that the mirror bat is, like, running along beside you guys. Because it seems like it's running at probably its like fastest speed that it can do long distances, which is just a casual stroll for everyone else. Because it's got little legs. So this little dude is following us, and I'm so <laughs> very. It's making me very uncomfortable. He's probably just making sure that we go to the main hall. I'm gonna try speaking to it in halfling to see if it'll leave us alone. It just squeaks at you. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> so. You make your way to the main hall, and the doors of this building you see are like the jaws of a massive creature. Cool. Uh, roll a history check. 18 plus th two plus, plus three. Okay. Not good. How not good? Seven. Oh, okay. At least it's not a one. Um, so, Bion, you have read a lot of stories about dragons, and this absolutely looks like a dragon's mouth. No, but no, you see no. that there's like a, a door. You see that the rest of it is just like a normal building. So are you suggesting I wouldn't know that this is a giant dragon? Uh, you're just like, it's some kind of weird lizardy thing. I don't. <laughs> Bion, Bion, this is us. <laughs> Bion, this looks really weird. This is a giant lizard thing. Have you ever seen or heard of anything like this before? I'm just giving Normalitas like the weirdest look and, and realizing that this is why he wants to go study. <laughs> <laughs> I need to know things. Listen, doesn't I doesn't know what half of this game is about. <laughs> I paid a halfling to read a book about dragons for me, <laughs> and even I know this is a dragon. <laughs> I've heard of dragons. Yes, yes, they're. They're quite large, and also they really love giving away their money. That's not what I read, but okay. I say we just go in the mouth and figure oh, this cool. out later. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so as you walk up the steps to this door, it automatically opens, and it opens inward. And you see inside, it looks like um, like the, the ribbed lining of an esophagus, like the interior of a creature. But I'm not see. sure where we were going with that. <laughs> uh, you know exactly where this, we're going. This is that. a Trojan dragon. <laughs> <laughs> uh, this dragon, made in Troy, you see like a little, little mark on the side. You've got a friend in dragon. Oh, this esophagus <laughs> is ribbed for her pleasure. Oh. <laughs> All right, so you make your way in, and yeah, you, you see that like, the, the walls are like the, the rib. They do look like the inside of some sort of creature's esophagus. But you see that it has torches along the wall in little sconces. And you see that it has um, like a, a stone floor, like <clears throat> mismatched. I, They're different sizes, but like it, it's bricks. Of can, I, can, can I make a nature check or, or some sort of check? I want to go over to the wall. Like, knowing, like, even if it's a big lizard, I know this, that this is the supposed carcass of a creature that maybe once has lived. Uh, but can I touch the wall or something like that to see if I can get into and to see if there's any sign of life? Sure. Oh. Would, would that be in nature? Frightening. Oh, what? Or a kana. Mm, you said nature first. So. Oh, I wish I did. <laughs> Two plus I three, know. five. This just feels like a wall. <laughs> yeah, it, it looks like a wall. It it doesn't seem like it's alive, but like 
what Man, what does the live even mean really i don't know but the masons who built this the structure are, are fantastic <laughs> at their job Man, look at this art. This is art. This looks like a real esophagus. Bio. Hey, hey uh, Bio, should we go? Uh, should, we, should we go in? Did I? Fr I froze. Oh, you just. Happened. You just. <laughs> <laughs> You're just admiring what's in front of us. I I completely understand. He's well, like, like I was doing some serious gluck gluck three thousand right. Well, now. like I knew Tim was ready to like stroke the furry wall. <laughs> and then, like, it just went quiet. So I don't know what happened. He, he uh, was investigating it. He was talking about the Masons who made it. And then you just were staring, like, a thousand-yard stare. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, bye. On the, the walls of this place are, are pretty are pretty sound. Those They're pretty. pretty. Sound foundation. These are some pretty walls. I'll be the judge of that. And I would like to use stone cunning and see if I can figure it out. Oh, no. Oh, you said stone cunning? Yeah. I thought you said stone cutting. So did I. I'm like, oh god. I'm like, okay. <laughs> I just start backing it up. <laughs> so with stone cutting, right? Like I get like a big bonus towards if it's stone. Is it big? Or do you just tell people it's big? Oh, it's it's rock hard too. Um, I, I don't think the like the, the walls didn't feel like stone to me, but I think this is unnecessary. They're, they're I'll fluffy. tell you if it's stone or not. It's fluffy. <laughs> I've seen every stone known to dwarf, and I tell you right now, I've never seen one that's fluffy. This is not stone. <laughs> so I'm just, I'm for simplicity's sake, gonna say like you go over to it, you knock on it, and you're like, this is absolutely stone. <laughs> fluffy stone. <laughs> I think we're focusing on the wrong thing here, but I think we should go in into the to the welcome uh, to to the new student welcome. Yes, but fluffy stone. I feel like yeah. I should take a sample. And I pull out my little knife. Uh, <laughs> is, it like a, is it like a cheese knife? <laughs> yeah. I'm just gonna. <laughs> and you're just like. <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> All right. Into the welcoming hall. Yes. Yeah. Now, now it is canon. The stone is cheese for dwarfs. <laughs> well, I mean, you know. Yeah. Anyway, there are no so... dwarven women, so. Just anyway, up out of the ground. Yeah. Anyway, so you guys continue down this hall, <laughs> and as you you walk up to these massive doors, you see that they are um, carved with the logo of the school on it, and they they immediately open with this loud creak, and as they open, literally everyone, like hundreds of students, all turn to look at you. And the headmaster just looks absolutely annoyed because you guys interrupted in the middle of the new student orientation. Okay, uh, I have I have to say something immediately. I have cast this almost instantly when I noticed what was about to happen because this is just Nick. I'm sorry, uh, Normal Tosta's life. <laughs> when we opened the doors and we noticed that everyone's eyes started to turn towards us, I immediately cast invisibility. <laughs> um, <laughs> so you do that. But as soon as you, you blink out of sight, it just dissipates. And... I fucking pee myself. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Normalitas I... just re like, Bion, you see that Normalitas briefly blinks out of existence, uh, visually at least. You can definitely Question. hear his heavy breathing, but he just disappears, uh, which you've seen him do a few times. And then immediately, before you could even blink yourself, he snaps right back. But question, do I know I snapped back out? Uh, roll a perception check. Well, I'm pretty damn good at that. 13? Um, you have some idea, but... Something, something's not right. Hey, Bonnie, can you see me right now? Uh, yes. <laughs> okay. okay, it didn't work. I'm really terrified. <laughs> I do want to. I know I'm taller and bigger than Bion, but I'm definitely going to like shrink back uh, to hide behind him because I feel really uncomfortable. Everybody staring at me. So as you are like kind of standing behind Bion, the headmaster says, "Well, are you coming in or not?" And you see that the headmaster at this podium um, is like on this raised dais, and you see that it is this floating head with one large eye, a very toothy maw, if you will, uh, and then multiple eyes 
surrounding its head on little stalks. That's the headmaster. I like that. I, I don't know if that's where you were going, but I like it. It wasn't intended, but he is the headmaster. <laughs> <laughs> uh, do we realize that it's a, a beholder? Behold like, the headmaster! Like, do we know? Do we know um, what that is? Both of you roll an arcana check. I don't know. 24. Is it a one? <laughs> hey. It's a two. <laughs> hey, hey Bion, did you know that the headmaster is a so beholder? Close. Do you know what a beholder is? What's a beholder? Well, you know that beauty is in the eye of the beholder. Yeah, there's not a lot of beauty in there. It is hideous and dark, and that is a vile, evil creature, according to what I read in my books. As as you say did, all that... Did you see that? Tim just blinked out of existence and came back. <laughs> in real life. So Why is it working? working? <laughs> my spell's not working. <laughs> the, the Molotovs, as you say that, you hear your voice echoing with, like, vile, evil, 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 evil creature. And it just says... Those are really rude stereotypes, and that is not a good first impression, new students. Please come in and take a seat. I'm sorry, but stereotypes are usually based on some sort of fact in the past. I'm sorry for judging you, but sometimes that's what you have to do. We get to make generalizations in some situations to be safe. I'm going to so. grab Normalitas by the shoulder <laughs> and just, like, drag him to a table. But I'm going to be, like, whispering I'm sorry, to him. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Be, like, whispering to him the whole time, like, Normalitas, do you think that, do you think he could be the leader of the International Guild of Assassins? Oh, definitely. They can <laughs> as you, they burn as people you alive. That, Bion, you hear your voice echoing, and <laughs> you can just see, like, two of the eye stalks are just, like, face palming. <laughs> like, oh, God. Beautiful. So, the, the orientation continues. Um, even though it is late in the evening, I mean, by the time you guys got to the Warty Hog Tavern, classes had ended for the day. Uh, other than, like, you know, the, the night classes for adult students who are coming back, like, who've already been in the workforce and wanted to come and get some schooling. Um, but, like, the normal young student, like, college-age classes had already ended, so you guys went to the tavern. It's now, like, late in the evening, and Important he question. just he groans on for a very long time. Is there food? No. Can I cast create food? No. You, you try to, and as this baklava pizza appears in front of you, it immediately <laughs> blinks out of existence. This oh darn! Oh darn! <laughs> so, uh, as he drones on, I mean, you guys are having a hard time staying awake by this point, and you see that there are a lot of students who absolutely have fallen asleep. Um, but as soon as they do, he like shoots a beam from one of his eye stalks at them, and they just immediately set bolt upright, uh, just like with a thousand yard <laughs> stare. Are they paralyzed? <laughs> <laughs> There's something. Fun. Yeah, there's something. <laughs> See, I told you he's evil. Each of those stalks does something super, super dangerous, Bion. Yes, yes. We should plan on killing him. Oh, no, I didn't say... Uh, I mean, arresting him. Arresting that, him. That, yes. that part echoes as well. <laughs> <laughs> We're not cops. We're not narcs. We're not cops. We're just students. Hello, fellow bad guys. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so you guys don't usually stay up quite this late, even though you're detectives, you know, you kind of have like the nine to five type job for the most part. And you know, it is well into the night. Um, by the time orientation wraps up, you guys are all absolutely dead tired. And you start to follow the other students back to what you assume are the dorms. Um, by the time you make it to your dorms, you see that the sun is starting to come up. Normalitas, I think, I think we may have made a bad impression with the headmaster. I think so too. I think he thinks that we're cops. <laughs> I mean, we are cops. Shh. So, but, but we're undercover. Right, and, right. I'm so right. good at it too. <laughs> right. Yes, I would also like to be under the covers. But what does that have to do with us being cops right now? I think that it's obvious. The headmaster is the leader of the international guild of assassins wait and i have another i have another question on malatos yes do we know what demos actually looks like yeah take a you have you have a picture of him wait didn't we give the picture to demetrios let's take another sketch of it it's right here oh right 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 
Okay, yes, yeah, it's a very bigger. it's a very <laughs> poor stick figure representation of your sketch. So like I'm like looking at it and I'm like comparing it to my memory of the headmaster and I'm like, yes, this is not the headmaster. Okay, and I give it back to. <laughs> well, no, you, you, yeah, you you had a picture of Demos, but not of like who took him. Right. No, but like in my head, I'm like, could Demos have been the beholder? <laughs> That's a stretch. Oh. But if he is, we'll have to kill him because he's the, he's the leader of the International Guild of Assassins. He can't be left to live. Uh, do we go back to the dorm? Are, are we in like Gryffindor or like are, are we in one of the dorms here? Yeah, you guys go back to your dorms. It, it's definitely yeah. I'm a little I'm a little mad that you didn't give us a sorting hat. This is a little yeah, a little a little, a little sus to be honest. Oh no, but... I mean you guys you guys were pre-sorted by Telamon. Oh, uh, what house are we in? That's a great question. I don't better be the cool one. Gonna... What? Better not be. Better not be the bad one. Better be the good one. Who, who are the it's bad Slytherin. one? It's Slytherin. Oh wait, are we bad boys? What? So are we in the bad boys? Uh, bad house? boys house. No, you guys are just bad at investigating. Yeah, so we're they're, the bad at investigating. They're more the bad boys. We're the Hufflepuffs. <laughs> Ooh, Huffle, Hufflepuff gang. Hufflepuff gang. Oh, if we weren't getting sued by J.K. Rowling, we definitely are now. Um, let's see. Can we be the elder flowers? So it, it's funny you say that. I, I literally just pulled up the, the art that I made for it, which I would screen share, but it's not on my computer, it's on my phone. Um, so it is the Epistemos house. Which say that again, the, the what? The Epistemos, Epistemos house, yep. Epistemos. Weirdly, the the fucking like auto transcript knew exactly what I was saying, even though it cannot get Nikitas or Bion right ever. What about who, what, who's Nikitas? What, what are you talking? Or Nomalitas, it or Frogatas or any of them. You can't get any of hey, those right. Hey, but but I want to clear something up real quick. You said Nikitas. You probably saw that on my paperwork. I just want to be clear. Uh, my last name is is Nikitas. <laughs> Just if you're ever confused. <laughs> uh, my name is Normalitas Nikitas. Uh, don't think any more into it. Okay? I will not think any more into that at all, ever. <laughs> and I immediately just, like, lock it back in my brain where it <laughs> ever will come up in my thought process <laughs> ever again. So we go so, to the Pistamos house. And yeah, and so the, their, um, like, emblem is an owl on a scroll which has these like uh, poppy flowers behind it. Mm. And you would know um, from the information that you didn't really read, you, like you skimmed it, that Telamon gave you, that this is like kind of the, the Ravenclaw of not Hogwarts. Yes, yes. Okay, we're the, the nerds. Smart house, which is really bad for... <laughs> yeah, uh i do want to get... 16 intelligence <laughs> really bad for me now when we get back into the into to the room i want to just make a little, a little bit of a scene and say um she tried to draw some information out like the common man. room or like yeah the, room? yeah the, no the common room okay man what a really long day but you know what made this day super cool i met a new friend man what was his name his name was <gasps> started with a d Demos. Man, does anybody know that kid Demos? He was so friendly. He welcomed us into this hall for our first day here. He is the perfect prefect. Is there, has, does anyone know what house he belongs to? And there's a, a bullywog who's just like, uh, you mean Demos the, the golem? Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, he might have been a golem, yeah. I mean, now that you think back on it, my uh, I remember the experience very well, but I didn't look too deep into him. He may have been a golem. Yeah, do you know where Demos is? Is, is he is he in uh, Pistamos' house? He's just like, do you do you not know? The golems are all at the synagogue. What are you, what are you talking about? Is he part of the DTP? No. Forget I said anything. Um... <laughs> I don't even remember what you said. Good, yeah. Um, synagogue. Okay. Uh, well, well, thanks. I mean, I really want to send a thank you letter to my to my best friend Demos, the potential <laughs> golem. 
over at the but whenever, whenever whenever he says to my best friend Demos, I'm immediately like looking at him like, I thought I thought I was your best friend. <laughs> hey, this is hey, fine. This is a bluff. Uh, it doesn't. And I start looking around in a panic, like I don't see any bluffs. And I'm pretty sure Demetrius is my best is my best bud. Oh, that that hurts my feelings. I mean, it shouldn't. Somewhere, just a single tear rolls down. Face. <laughs> I mean, it shouldn't. <laughs> uh, Demetrius is just like looking longingly at the, the picture of his brother. <laughs> uh, just, that, I mean, it shouldn't. That's all right. I'm done. <laughs> Are you though? I'm leaving. I'm going somewhere else. Yeah, I'm going to go take a long. I'm going to go uh, uh, study a little bit and take a long rest. Okay. And, uh, what are you studying? Uh, it's got to be whatever class uh, Kino was was teaching. I think was that the the monster one, the the mystical creatures, magical animals, and how not to kill them. Yep, that was it. Yeah. Yeah, I've read like I've read through the whole the whole manuscript. Like I am. Actually, can I can I roll like a. Like an intelligence check to see how well I retain the knowledge sure. I, I read through. Uh, that would be a. I guess it's a straight intelligence check. Roll plus three. Unnatural twenty. I am really like really into this school thing. Dirty twenty. Very like good. you know what? Like if I wasn't a cop, maybe I'll stay here. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I get even a real though, education. Even though you went to hamstring. <laughs> I did go to hamstring, yes, yes. Oh, that's where I thought we were. That's what I thought this place was. No, no, no. For like the 30th time, this is not hamstring. As much as we want it to be hamstring. <laughs> yeah, I mean, initially, whenever you first got there, you're like, I'm wearing my hamstring shirt. Oh, I was just at the wrong school. Got it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, so... You, you hear a couple of the other students are, like, just talking in hushed whispers over in the corner. Um, and then the little, the bullywog guy is just like, well, I'm going to bed. Okay. Sorry, I'm practicing my impressions. I'm an impressionist. That's what I want to be when I grow up. He's like, that really sucked. That really hurts. That's not encouraging <laughs> at all. And I look at my, I, I look at normalitas, and I'm like, well, you, you shouldn't. That shouldn't hurt. You should. You should not be surprised. <laughs> but I really don't like you right she now. She said you should not be surprised. Yeah. <laughs> actually, can I roll a performance check to see how well I actually sound? Sure. Like? Nope. Oh too my late. god. It's a it's a literal natural one. Oof. Oh. You know what? And, Maybe I won't quit my day job. As a student. Like, a student. As you're, like, continuing to try and perfect this impression. I'm going to bed. <laughs> One of the other students just, like, throws a lot of parchment at you. It's just like, shut up. Hey, whoa, this is a good book. You're going you're gonna to bend the pages. <laughs> I put it back and make it look nice. What, what, what book is it? Um, it, It's the book on, um, it's a signed copy from Keena on how not to kill monsters. She didn't write this. <laughs> A signed copy. <laughs> well, this is a this is a fraudulent book, pretended to be written by. I mean, by, uh, it was you know. assigned, but it was actually you know actually you know what it it is the is the blog articles that Keena wrote about the book. <laughs> it's her research uh, paper. Yeah, yeah, it's her master's thesis. Yes, this is On great stuff. Thank, thank you. I, I can have this. Thank you so much. <laughs> She's like, no, absolutely fucking not. Don't keep it. You threw it at me. It's mine now. That's the rule. Oh, no. What, what was thrown at you was just like a blank piece of parchment. Well, that is not what I said. You can take the blank parchment back. They were just telling you to shut that. up, and they were just throwing like the nearest thing at them. Like, nearest thing to them at you. Hey, bud, I'm not doing this like this, this fraternizing thing very well. No, you're <laughs> not. And you shouldn't be surprised. <laughs> You know, it does stay. No. I'm, I'm so, I, I am sorry for what I said. <laughs> Hades hath no fury like a bion scorned. Oh, <laughs> uh, that's going on a shirt right there. <laughs> uh, I, I do want to cast message uh, to Bion. Okay. Um, while, while everyone's like laughing and yelling at me and telling me to shut up, I just want to say. So you're texting him in the same room, basically? Yeah. Um, I actually write on the blank parchment that they threw at me. And I wrote a little <laughs> note. And that's my message. I throw it to him. And it just says. I'm sorry for hurting your feelings. You are my <laughs> You cast message by writing on a piece of parchment. <laughs> <laughs> it's 
Is that what Nikitas thinks magic is? Is that why? Yes. He... <laughs> I'm actually like a street magician. So wait, uh, did, he, did you really throw me a piece of paper with if I'm sorry on it? Yes. Uh, it says, a... I'm sorry, you are my best friend. Is there a fire nearby? <laughs> There's no commas. It just says, I'm sorry, <laughs> you're my best friend. <laughs> 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 oh shit! <laughs> That's I mean, the I'm, best wait, 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 wait! I, I realized what I did, and I cast minor illusion, and I add a comma. <laughs> Too late. <laughs> you, yeah, you you definitely see that like a wild comma appears. So, is there a fire place? Oh, for sure. Is there a fire in it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I just tossed the note nope. casually into the nope, fire. Nope. nope, before he does that, I cast <laughs> sleep on him. <laughs> Not man hand or anything like that. Just sleep, just go to sleep. I'm casting sleep at, at second level. <laughs> uh, so uh, is that a wisdom save? No, I just, what's your, oh, and I have to roll 5d8. Uh, so add another, okay, just 5d8. Oh, uh, 68, 78. I roll 78. That's the 100. Hold on. Where's my D8? All right, so... Bion, what's your health? 38. Really? Damn. I'm a cleric. Boy, and a dwarf. Beefy. All right, Beefy well, boy. Rolled, well, my 78 I only got 25, so you don't fall asleep. Like some kid next to you, <laughs> yeah, just, <laughs> just studying, just just knocks out. Uh, but I was targeting you. Uh, but you're you're fine, apparently. Do I realize what just happened? <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> like you, you I... just watch the kid next to you, like this <laughs> little. <laughs> I just, just like this, I just... this generic human, like normalitas, but more normal somehow just like zonks out going from like he's writing a letter home to his parents and his girlfriend back home and uh yeah just immediately face down on this note poor kid <laughs> i just stare at normalitas and shake my head slowly the deception i'm going to bed and then i just like <laughs> go find a bed and lay down yeah so, find a bed as well so you know as you're throwing your tantrum by on, you notice that those suspiciously whispering kids in the corner are still whispering suspiciously. They have not stopped it. being suspicious I, or whispering. I forgot, I forgot about the suspicious whispering. <laughs> I know. I'm well aware. Can, can I cast invisibility now? After I got sure, my feet right here, that was it. Yeah, um, by on, I guess it's like you hear them and you like nudge me. Like, do nudge me and let me know, like, hey, those kids are still being annoying. You also hear the whispering kids. I mean, okay, then yeah, then I'm gonna like go up to bed because I feel like, like they're like they're stealing glances at me, and I don't really don't like it. So as I go up to the room, <laughs> I cast the visibility and come back down, and and I would just want to get close enough to hear hear or listen in on the conversation. Okay, uh, roll a stealth check with advantage because I'm invisible. Sure. Thirteen, and then an unnatural twenty. Okay. Um, so, as you're like spying on them, you hear, "Hey, so I heard this like this uh, this cool club that do you really have to like know the right people?" But my brother was in it, and uh, I think he can get me in. And one of the other kids is just like, "Oh, like what do they do, man?" And he's just like, they know stuff. Like they can, they can teach you stuff that the teachers don't want you to know. Like what? <laughs> <laughs> and immediately, like there, there's three of them. All three of them just like jump. The table flips accidentally. Like they just panic, and they, they all three bolt in different directions. <laughs> Man. I was told I was a narc. <laughs> <laughs> it was very subtle. 
If I waited, I probably could have got more information. <laughs> like like <then>. what? <laughs> <laughs> That's the most normalitas thing to ever happen on this show. Well, he blinked again. He blinked out of existence. <laughs> His spell is super faulty. Uh, well, I ran out of um, second level spells, so I'm going to go to bed now. Bion, <laughs> uh, what are you doing? I'm in bed. Oh, you, you weren't doing anything with those sus kids? Nope, I was just like, fuck them kids. <laughs> um, as as Bion's laying in bed, I, I crawl <laughs> into bed next to him. <laughs> and, and I just want to say, hey, I saw you eyeing those kids too. For one, everybody has a really cool voice. Hold on, um, really, really important them. question before you proceed. Big spoon or little spoon? I'm um, big spoon. <laughs> oh, it's, it'd, be weird no if I, it'd be weird if I cuddle into his bed as the little spoon. I'll do it though. You know what? I am the little spoon. Yeah, you're, like, you're trying to apologize. I mean, of course you're the little I, spoon. I, I snuggle into the bed and just get into his arms <laughs> and into his crotch. And I say, <laughs> hey, <laughs> hey Bion, I know that you were checking out those kids, so I I, I know we're on the we're on the outs right now, and you you feel hurt, but I guess I did some investigating for you, and I discovered that that the cool kid who sounds like the other kid, um, he knows people, and there's a club for people who know things, and his brother got in, and they know stuff that teachers don't teach you about, and I really want to know what it is. I just well, like, uh, do I know who the kid was? That he have like a name cat? Like I, I imagine first day of school, everyone's got name badges on, right? Do, do I know what the name of this kid is? Well, I mean, you you studied the roster, like you know. Oh yeah, because I'm a cop. And a I'm nerd. A, I'm, a, I'm a narc, narc nerd. I just like look at What's him. What's his name? Like, well, Byron. I was say, I just like look at uh, Normalitas. And have a candle. Like, I'm, I'm just like, have a candle in the bed. <laughs> yes, Bayon. What? Why are you in my bed? There are other beds. But it's lonely over there. <laughs> you didn't even try it. Did you hear anything I said? There's a cool ass. I say it really loud now. There's a cool ass club. I'm trying to get in. What club? I don't know, but it's a club where people know. It's called the. People who know stuff club. I don't think it's for nerds. No, it's for cool kids. The nerds go to class. The cool kids go to this place. Hmm. I don't know. Just well, I'm getting like major Carmen San Diego vibes every time you look down and I can't see your face. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. I love it. Like I'm not. I'm not talking shit on it. I just can't help but think of Carmen San Diego every time. My hair is a mess. We're putting this back on. <laughs> Where in the world is Normalitas San Diego? <laughs> so like, right, I, I go to my own bed and I go to sleep. I almost have nothing to do with me. <laughs> I cast message right before he falls asleep and says, I love you. <laughs> you, can can reply, you can reply gonna, back. Gonna you gonna have say, a chance to reply, reply back. back. My, my reply would just be, shut up. <laughs> No, it's just K, period. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Beautiful. Beautiful. The bromance just blossoming. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay. This is, what, this is what it's like to go camping with me. <laughs> That's pretty accurate. Can't Shut compare. up. <laughs> Would you assholes go to sleep? I'm trying to sleep. So I'm usually the asshole who's not going to sleep. <laughs> uh, so normally we would we would probably go sneaking around trying to find this club, but I think we're really tired. After the first day, I think we should get some sleep. I mean, it's daylight <laughs> now. 